Where are we going, guys? To the garden. To the garden. Yeah. What are we picking today? Can. Some corn, that's right. <laughs> Some can. You can, yeah. Do what? The friend though, if you have a that a bag, I throw in the glass. Throw it in the grass, that's right. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you guys stopping by. Uh, we just got through picking our gym corn. We're taking a break. It is so humid out here. It's ridiculous. But we just picked all the gym corn and we thought we would take a break because right across from the gym corn is our muscadines. And look guys, they are just... Look, she just wants to eat them one after another. Are they yummy? Hmm? Are they your favorite fruit? <laughs> they are just getting going look at that they're just getting going these are our two-year plants all down through here and we're, we're going to end up doing the whole pasture with these they are absolutely phenomenal and for second year i mean look at that they're just loaded with grapes just loaded and they go all the way down they're just mm, nothing better you want another one? You can have all you want. There, sweetie. There, here's your another one. But guys, <laughs> I'm out here with my niece, Destiny. We're taking a little break. Fishing to go. Shuck this gym corn. We're super excited. We're just out here uh, looking at the watermelons and how bad they are. I was talking about making a video on cleaning those up. And we came down here to the gym corn. Uh, we did shuck one open and just said, they're ready. Let's let's pull them and see what they look like. We're super excited. We're going to go back to the house. I think we got, how many did we get? Two five-gallon buckets full? Yeah. We got two five-gallon buckets, and they're not the biggest corn ever. Uh, sort of a small corn. We had some that were pretty big. Uh, but, man, they are beautiful. And we're super excited to get home and shuck all of them. Mason bailed on us early. It's just so hot and humid. And I've said it before. We don't make these kids do all this stuff. They want to get out here and have some fun, but look what Mason missed out on. He missed out, didn't he? Mason should have stayed. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> These things are unbelievable. Kim's already went and picked a whole bucket uh, yesterday. We got our first bucket yesterday, and they're really not actually due to be, to be ripe until a couple more weeks. Mm -hmm. But some of these vines will give you fruit a little early. Mm-mm-mm. But anyway, we're going to eat some more of these muscadines and head to the house. Stick around. Let's go see what this gym corn looks like. What's that one looking like? Got some blue in it. Mm-hmm. More blue than purple. It's pretty. Bugs started getting it. Can I see this one 
have the odd one, the odd one. Oh, That's, yeah. That one turned out pretty. Oh, that is pretty. Look at that. We've gotten some bad ones. Uh, we got some that just didn't turn out. Of course, I knew that. They're not going to all be 100%. And we didn't do anything to these as far as fertilizing or anything. I believe if we would have fertilized them and really, I say stay on top Whoa. of them, we, we did them pretty good. We'd have got some better corn, but we, we're getting about, we got a couple of really nice ones. We got some really nice ones. Emma, I think, is working on a really nice one. We found some bugs in some. But we're getting some really, really cool colors going. So we're going to keep shucking. We got... We have a ton that we have to shuck real quick. We're going to shuck it, set it on this table right behind us. Yeah, see, we got some that just didn't quite turn out. But that's okay. The colors are just crazy. Those blues right there are just... <laughs> I was messing with it earlier. The one we picked had some jade-looking color, and I just, I just love that. Look at that. Just unbelievable. It's really pretty corn. Look at Mason's. Mason got a good one. What's it get, buddy? Yeah, you, it's on right here. Yeah. It's pretty neat, huh? Yeah. Emma's yeah, still working on her. My pop. I do Do it from the top side, honey. Do it from the top side. We'll let Emma keep working on hers. gang not too bad of a haul that, one, that is just ridiculous really pretty I swear I had one piece I thought was my favorite this looks more like that red Indian corn I've seen just super pretty corn I wish they were bigger uh, they're just not quite as big as what I thought they were going to be uh, maybe if I would have fertilized them or took a little better care of them uh, they would have grown better. It's my first time growing them, and I just want to say thanks to Paula Wells. Go check out her channel, Paula Wells, on YouTube. Subscribe to her channel. Tell her I said thank you so much. I know she's watching this, Paula. Thank you so much for gifting this to me. Uh, we're going to let all this dry out on the table, uh, break it down, and I want to start giving a bunch of it away. I'm not planning on selling anything. I'm going to keep a bunch to plant for next year, but I want to get this dirt dauber. Get out of here. I want to start planting, uh, giving a bunch of this stuff away to friends. Uh, subscribers and, and I got a bunch of channels in line I want to send some to uh, channels in mind I want to send some to so super excited about the gym corn I wished I would have took better care of it but I wasn't really sure what to do with it outside of I could have probably fertilized it but look at that look at those blues and pinks and just crazy colors I swear it's just really remarkable what the colors you get from all that but with gym corn, uh, I've read that you can make grits out of it. Uh, you can make cornmeal and popcorn. Uh, I doubt we'll do any of that because there just don't seem to be quite enough. It may look like it on camera. It looks like there's a whole bunch, but when you're, <laughs> there's really not. There's not a bunch. Uh, but it's enough to give a bunch away. So I'm super excited about that. I love doing that. The guys. Which one was your favorite? Are oh, you gonna show me your favorite? Emma, come pick your favorite out. I picked. Uh oh. Which I one was your favorite? Let me look. Can you find it? You had a favorite? One. That one. Why was that? Because of all the pinks. Hey, Emma's my... favorite color. What's your favorite color? My, my favorite ones are these ones. Oh yeah. <laughs> awesome. All right, guys, sorry about the interruption. Uh, we had some uh, family members that were leaving. Uh, the kids, they went inside. I just want to say thank you guys so much for being subscribers to my channel. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, take the minute to click that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you have a comment, leave it in the comments below. If you want to learn anything about Jim Corn, don't ask me. I don't have a clue what I'm doing. We planted it. We watered it. 
we hoped for the best, and here's what we got. Uh, I think it did pretty good. Uh, we didn't fertilize it. I'm absolutely just in love with the colors that this stuff gave us. That pink is ridiculous, and the purples is just really, really fun. I think that's Destiny's favorite. She keeps picking up that one. Just super, super cool looking corn. I plan on growing more of this next year. Like I said earlier, we're going to break this down. We're going to let it sit out here dry, break it down. I want to give some to some of my, some of my subscribers. I want to give some to some of my favorite channels. Hopefully, they'll get a chance to grow it next year. Um, I'm just blown away at it. Thank you so much, Paula Wells, for sending this to me. Go check out her channel and subscribe to her channel, too. Uh, she is a gardening fool this year. She's really doing a lot in her garden this year. A lot of fun watching her. But thanks again, guys. I'm going to go ahead and close this out. I want to say I love you guys to death. Like I say again, subscribe, like, share. All you guys that are subscribers, thank you so much for being a part of the Kim Foot Farm family. See you all on the next video.